Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praise, glory, and honor to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash. That's all praise to the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, who the world ignorantly calls God, in the name of Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, in the name of the Holy Spirit. I want to give a double honors to my apostles and elders of Great Millstone that taught me this truth. And I want to say a sincere shalom, wa barakatham, to the hopeful elect, the men that are prophesying and laboring in the correct doctrine of Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, through the Throughout the four winds of the world. Shalom. All right, I want to do this quick lesson on this article and just to show you how, how Esau is a joke and how this wicked ass society, um, America, Babylon the Great, all right, and Esau, Edom, you Edomites as a race are going down, all right? And they're just trying to, to, trying to do any and everything to preserve their kingdom, but it, it, it's going to fail, okay? And the title of this article. Um, Homeland Security is reportedly considering labeling fentanyl as a weapon of mass destruction. All right. And that just shows you how how um, desperate Esau is. OK. And fentanyl is the opioid, the synthetic opioid that is is has the is a key contributor to wiping a lot of Edomites out. All right. Um, a, a lot of our people, you Israelites, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans aren't aren't hooked on these opioids. You know, our people may. May uh, 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 the wicked of our people may indulge in this stuff and pop pills and stuff, but this is an Edomite thing, all right. This is something that is prevalent amongst the Edomite uh, uh, um, people, all right. You so called white people, all right. So I'm not gonna read this whole article because really I really don't need to read the whole article because the, the 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 title says it all, all right. But I'm gonna just read some uh, uh, read a little bit of the article and uh, pull out some precepts. And Lord willing, this lesson is edifying. All right. It uh, it reads, the Department of Homeland Security is considering classifying fentanyl as a weapon of mass destruction or WMD, according to the internal memo attained by military news outlet task and purpose. All right. When you think of weapons of mass destruction, you think of when Bush went into um, what was it? I, 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 Iran or Iraq. During their, um, I believe it was like around 2001, 2002. All right, weapons of mass destruction. This is, all right, I doubt, I highly doubt that, uh, um, you know, even though there was no weapons of mass destruction during that time, that they're looking, they went in there looking for fentanyl, okay? Why wasn't it a weapon of mass destruction when um, crack cocaine and heroin um, were, were, were um, you know, flooded through the, um, the, um, you Negroes, Latinos, you Israelites communities, all right, in the um, the 60s, 70s, 80s, it wasn't considered a weapon of mass destruction, all right, because it was destroying the community of you Israelites, all right, when it's when it's when it's starting to destroy, and um, the effects are being shown uh, um, nationally and even globally to so some aspects, um, it's considered a weapon of mass destruction, okay, and it is uh, um, destroying you Edomites, okay. All right, back to the article. Um, the memo said the painkiller would be labeled a weapon of mass destruction when certain criteria are met, that the federal officials have long regarded fentanyl as a chemical weapon threat. Man, Esau's, Esau's reaching, man, because, you know, I haven't come in contact with this substance, but, man, I doubt that it, it, it is, unless you in, ingest it into your body, you're all right, it, it is, you know, it, it can do little harm to you. It's not like, I, I believe it's not like no anthrax or nothing like that. So, like I said, each of Esau is, is reaching right here. Fentanyl is a powerful synthetic opioid that can be up to a thousand times more potent than morphine. It is prescribed as to treat severe pain, but is also sold illegally in the U.S. Fentanyl-related deaths in this country spiked more than 1,000 percent from 2011 to 2016, according to the Center for Disease Control and Prevention. In 2017, more than 28,000 U.S. citizens fatally overdosed on the drug. Okay? And, and the majority of those 28,000 people were, 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 um, were more than likely Edomites. All right? You, um, you so-called white people. All right? Because, like I said, you, you so-called white people are heavy into this. All right? And it's all through the spirit of Yahweh Shem Shai that he's taking you out. Through your own devices, all right. Through through something that you 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 crave for that you love, he's taking you out. You're overdosing on this on this synthetic drug, all right. The, this fentanyl, all right. The the drug high the drugs high tox toxic toxicity 
and increasing availability are attractive to potential adversaries seeking non-conventional materials for a chemical attack. James McDonald, an assistant secretary of DHS, wrote in the memo according to task and purpose. These other countries ain't worried about no, no weak ass fentanyl or no shit like that. These other countries have ICBM missiles. All right. The major players, Russia, China, Iran, North Korea. OK, they're not worried about no, no weak shit like this. All right. They, they kill a few few thousand. They're trying to kill millions, hundreds of thousands. All right. That's the numbers that these other countries are looking at. OK, they're not they're not worried about no, no small numbers. All right. They're, they're thinking about World War Three. They're thinking about being next in line as a superpower, as the ultimate superpower um, and, uh, to rule this world. All right. But they got another they they that's what they're thinking. That's what they're planning for. But the Israelites got next. OK. Well, um, let me see. Back to the article. Let me see. I'm going to read a little bit more. Um, the memo said the countering weapons of mass destruction of office would only focus on quantities and configurations of drug that could be used as mass casualty weapons. And the people that are bringing this shit into the country or, or, or producing it are Edomites. All right. That shows you how wicked these Edomites are, man. They, they don't give a shit if they're killing their own people. All right. Just like your 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 your, your two third nigga drug dealer in the neighborhood, he's dealing crack cocaine and and um, meth to his own people. He don't care uh, that he kills his own people as long as he gets that buck. All right, and Esau's on a whole different scale because they're mass producing this stuff. All right, and, and they're pushing it out through these pharmacies, and these Edomites are going to get their hands on it. All right, just like a crackhead can get his hands on that crack, whether well, they got to sell they, they mama's TV and sofa or, or or whatever. Okay. That's how the Edomites are going. And these Edomites are going, man, they, they're taking it hit, taking a big hit. All right. Um, what the memo doesn't spell out the details of it and what quantities and what they, it's like, and what do they mean by configurations? Kuhlman said, all right, let me see. So that's just really the point, man. Edomites, these Edomites are trying to uh, deem this uh, fentanyl as a, a weapon of mass destruction. As you know, as something that is uh, that 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 basically, um, if you get caught with this, you're you're deemed a terrorist. All right, you're you're you know they're they're trying to to put a stop, basically try to put a stop, try to preserve their 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 race and their kingdom. All right, but they're 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 failing sorely. All right, so let me get some scriptures. Um, let me see. First script I want to get is Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes uh, chapter 3 and I'm going to jump down to verse 17. I said in my heart, the most high shall judge the righteous and the wicked for there is a time there for every purpose and every work. All right. So, and this is the time, this is the time of Esau's judgment. All right. Esau is, is, is they're getting, they haven't ultimately got judged, but they're slowly getting judged. All right. And, and it's coming in a form of um, something that they created. All right. That 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 the, their own devices using their own devices, using their own resources. They created this synthetic drug and it's and it's killing them. All right. Um, kind of next group I want to get is uh, Deuteronomy talking about the curses coming on them. 30 and verse seven. And the Lord, thy power will put all these curses upon thy enemies and on them that hate thee, which persecuted thee. All right. And that's what the most high is doing. All right, the the the, the so called eat um Salakia, so called white man, you Edomites have been the number one enemy of Israel. All right, since 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 forever. Okay, and, and the Lord is putting these curses on you. All right, that was a curse of our people. All right, our, our people were cursed with the uh, um the the crack epidemic, heroin. All right, uh, um even even meth. Okay, but now the, the, these these curses are slowly coming on you Edomites. OK, and, you know, they don't know what to do. All right. It said the, the in the article, it said that the, 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 the numbers had increased a thousand percent from 2000 and I believe 2011 to 2016. All right. I read a, 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 a similar article to this one where they said in Canada, there are um, they, they, they don't have any room for the bodies. All right. They have to rent. They have to have the, the morgue. The morgue has to rent meat trucks. To uh, store the bodies in, so they won't decompose. All right, that's how it's getting. That's how bad it's getting. All right, and the same, the same, 
The same troubles are coming here to America to you Edomites. All right, next verse I want to get is Psalms chapter uh, 7 and verse 15. He made a pit and digged it and is fallen into the ditch which he made. His mischief shall return upon his own head and his violent dealing shall come upon him, uh, come upon his own pate. All right. So this Edomites, they dig the ditch. All right. For you Israelites to fall in. All right. But they're falling in their own ditch. All right. They're falling. Uh, um, they're falling uh, uh, to their own devices. All right. To, the, to their own snares, all right? His mischief shall return upon his own head, all right? And that's what Esau does. Esau sits in the lab and, and, and creates these uh, synthetic opioids, um, synthetic marijuanas, and all this wicked-ass shit, all right? But all their mischief that they do in the dark is falling upon their own head, own head all right? And their violent dealings shall come upon his own pate, all right? Um See, next verse I want to get is in Psalms um, 28 and uh, verse 4. Give them according to their deeds and according to their wickedness of, the, of, of their endeavors. Give them after the work of their hands. Render them their desert because they regard not the works of the Lord nor operations of his hands and shall destroy them and build them up. And, and not build them up. All right. So the Lord is giving them, giving them according to their deeds. All right. Their deeds were to, to, to kill. Um, what does it say in John 10 and 10? Kill the thief come of not to, but to kill, steal and destroy. Or, and that's what they've done. All right. Then the Lord's given them to according to their own deeds. All right. You got Edomites. Um, um, numbers are dwindling. All right. They, 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 you know, they're, they're, they're getting, they're getting depressed. They're um, re, uh, resorting to, to drug use. A lot of them are committing suicide. All right. And Esau is, is a, you know, Esau is catching hell right now. And this is just the beginning. All right. Like the scripture says in um, Matthew, the 24th chapter, this is the beginning of sorrows. All right. It's going to be sorrow, of course, upon our own people with um, Jacob's trouble. But hey, this is just the beginning of your sorrows, Esau. All right. You're going to, you're, 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 you're your men, your women, all right, your kids are going to go through all of this, all right? This is just the beginning, all right? Because, so like, uh, let me see, give them after the work of their hands, render them their dessert, all right? And this is Esau. Esau got his hands all in this, all right? And Esau's trying to, um, now trying to uh, um, sue the pharmaceutical companies, all right, and blame them for um, this, you know, this, this fentanyl, this opioid epidemic, all right? But, hey. Who, who's the head of that? All right. You, you don't know Israelites own these uh, pharmaceutical companies. All right. No Negroes, Latinos or Native Americans own any of these big pharmaceutical countries. It's all Edomites. All right. Edomites are are, 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 are wiping out their own people. All right. And, and, and it's all through the spirit of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh The Most High is doing this. All right. Um, last couple of verses I want to get. I want to jump to Galatians. Salak. Galatians 6 and verse 7, be not deceived, the most high is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. For he that soweth to his flesh shall, so like, that's why I just wanted that verse. So these Edomites pushed out iniquity and wickedness, all right? And that's what they're getting back. That's what they're reaping, all right? And I'm and the men of the Lord do not feel sorry for you, all right? We're not going to put up a prayer for you or, or, or cry. All right, because you done push nothing forth but wickedness throughout the four corners of the world. All right, with your with your wicked philosophies, you rule the world with your sword. All right, and and you know you just been a a, a a devil, a deceiver. All right, through your whole existence. All right, and everything that you put forth is coming back on your own damn head. All right, this is Job. This is the last verse I want to get. Um, it's Job chapter four verse eight. Even as even as I have seen. They that plow iniquity and sow wickedness reap the same. All right. So you Edomites plow iniquity, sin upon sin. All right. And sowed wickedness. You're going to reap the same and you're reaping the same right now. All right. Whether you want to whether you want to um, uh, 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 deem fentanyl uh, 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 weapons of mass destruction or not. OK. Um, hey, it's mad. It's, 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 it's massively destroying you Edomites. That's what it's doing. All right. And you can't do nothing about it. You can't put any laws into place. Uh, uh, um, you know, you could try. 
You could put the laws into place, but you either might still going to get your hands on these drugs and you're going to, you know, continue to wipe yourself out. All right, so that's all I had on this lesson, man. Lord willing, this lesson was edifying. I want to give all praise, glory, and honor to you. How about Shem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakakwadash, double honor to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Peace, citations to the hopeful elect. Shalom.